hello guys welcome to my channel today we will see how to convert the net cdf uh, file format to raster rare using arcgis uh, pro so net cdf which stands for the network common data format is a file format in the software library commonly used in scientific data analysis and the data visualization of data storage in the this net cdf uh, or the Network common data format files are uh, self-describing in the platform independent data types and uh, meaning they can be uh, easily exchanged between uh, different computer systems without losing their original uh, metadata or their original structure or format. So today we will see how to convert the NetCDF rainfall data into the raster layer using ArcGIS Pro uh, geoprocessing tool. So uh, if you see, uh, we are going to first download the NetCDF uh, global uh, rainfall data from the Climatic Research Unit uh, data portal. It is a very high resolution uh, graded data set and uh, derived products. So uh, we first download this data and then convert this NetCDF data into the raster layer. So uh, the CRU or the Climatic Resource or Research Unit's data is a data set was was uh, developed and has been subsequently up updated and improved with the support from the numbers of funders uh, particularly from the uk or united kingdom national environmental research council and that is from the u.s department of energy so uh, we need first to download the high, this high resolution graded rainfall data to download the data just go to this website you can get the link from the v this video description and uh, you have some description about the data and uh, there are also uh, blogs about this uh, rainfall data so just to get the data you can click this local copy link then select this uh, file so here there are variables so we are going to download for, for the precipitation already just click this pre here we have a rainfall for different years as you can see and the latest download for the year 2022 and uh, i'm going to download for uh, 2022 here so the download is already started i have already downloaded the data so this data format or this rainfall data format is uh, accessed from this uh, website is in its neat cdf uh, file format so the geoprocessing toolbox in ArcGIS pro can help us to convert this net cdf data into the uh, raster layer so once you have downloaded the data you can just go to your uh, browser and extract it to your uh, file and this is the net cdf data is in this video so open your arcgis pro and in the geoprocessing tab search for the make net cdf uh, raster layer this one geoprocessing tool or multi-dimensional uh, special analysis nice tool to create a new raster layer from the net cdf data So the tool is uh, here, so we are going to input the NCD file from our uh, computer or from the download folder. This is my rainfall. So the variable here will be the precipitation uh, variable. So uh, you have to select the precipitation or PRE. 
then x dimension will be the longitude and the y dimension will be the latitude and for the output raster layer you can give the name of the output so as uh, can keep it as precipitation layer or PRV so the band for the band dimension we are going to use the time one so once you have uh, filled the parameters you can just click the run So this job processing tool will create a new raster layer which presents the uh, rainfall data for uh, the entire world which is converted from the neat CDF uh, data format. So you can see uh, for the 2022 the precipitation data will be uh, displayed in raster format like this. You can change the symbology of the data just click the layer. Now go to this symbology tab. We can change the rendering or the data representation to from the RGB to the stretch type. And then we can change the color lamp to the different color lamp from this symbology. And also we can change the stretch type to the standard division or uh, minimum maximum distribution. So you can just uh, change the stretch type to more visualize the data in a meaningful manner and then you can also uh, add your shape file and extract the precipitation for your specific area. So this is how you can change the NACDF data format into the raster uh, layer in ArcGIS Pro. So this is all about my to-do tutorial. Thank you for your time and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you in the next tutorial.